came in a vulture, Tony Creates, and we continue with our exile journal. And I haven't even tidied up from the last craft, so we just have to go like this, folks, and we go like this, and just quickly pop that in here. Okay, sorry about that. So, how have you guys been? I'm delighted to be back to this. Right, so what I want to do today is um, I've now sorted them out so they are exactly the same. <laughs> so I just want to, we have this great big white, whitish page. So I just want to decorate this. So on this one we've got a bit of colour on. On the other one I've got nothing. So I had this idea. Right, so on this side there's like a texture I can't remember what paper this is I'm sure I've said so this one's already got some interest on it so we can just stick pockets on this this one hasn't so I think what we're going to do is we're just going to whack some color on there so I'm just going to take my uh, um, my paints and I'm just randomly going to put some color on here just like that so um, uh, let's go with our sepia first and I'm just gonna I think this might be a multimedia paper I hope it is because we're just going to randomly put some color down on here just so that it's not so boring and then my turquoise and I'm not gonna fuss and I'm not gonna uh, make them even or the same or anything like that I'm just bunging it on just like that sepia and turquoise that's here yeah. That's it. This one we can should actually do I not have a bigger brush it would help me I'm getting a strain in my arm. Can't find a bigger let's get this out. This is an our cheapo set I got. Should actually put all these brushes away. And I just want a nice big fat round brush. Here we go, that one's a bit bigger. What's this number 12? That's also a number 12. Okay, I don't have a bigger one. Just gonna stick all these back like that. Keep things nice and tidy. Put them back. Okay, we'll just carry on using this one. Oh, wait, yeah. What's this one? The number 8. Okay. Oh, baby, let's go. Okay, I think that's it. I don't think we need to do any more than that. Let's just get a little bit more here. Okay, so that's done. Oops, yeah, I think I stuck it in the wrong... There. Okay, so that page has got color. Okay, so we're going to leave that to dry and we're going to dry this up. And just rinse our brushes and dry them out and put them where we can find them again. <coughs> okay, now the real simple thing for and the other side of the page is I want to use our, our this is our sellotope that we made 
uh, faux washi, sellotape washi. So I thought they're really, they're really good. They're really good. So this is what I want to do. This is not going to work like this, matey. I have to just get this. Put this down. It's quite static. And get this. And I just want to go like that. Make sure we have a bit of glue on there. And I'm just going to go like that. Stick that down there. Oh, isn't that fabulous? Okay, so we've got that color, we've got that color. I think I want to go with the blue. Okay, the blue. Let's use the blue. Okay. Come on. Whoops. And make the blue. I'm gonna go this way and I'm gonna go like that. Okay. Okay, let's do the other side. I'm gonna have to use the purple one. This isn't working for me. It's all over the place and it's got fluffy bits on it. Let me get my glue book out. Just stick. Just don't go and stick this on the on the actual. Okay. And this one we're gonna stick right down here. Whoopsie. And with the glue on it underneath you can move it like you need to and then um, the blue okay oops get you down get some glue on you okay and you I'm gonna go like this stick you like that okay so we have that like that like that and now folks I want a stamp right I've got the stamp that Lude gave me um, let me get my stamp basket out and then I've got little ones but I don't think I want to put the little ones um, we might have get L but this one let's do one with this so let's get just hold hold fingers guys that it sticks on our cello tape and I just want to get this sorry my, oops, oopsie. my spongy spongy whoops underneath here like that. and then what have I got here what's this mess I've made here and then I'm just gonna come like that okay well, I've got ink on myself oh you know Okay. There we go. I like that. I like that. And I'm going to give it a minute to uh, to settle on there. Okay. Let's see. Is this page paper dry yet? No, it's not. Okay, but what I'll whatever I'm doing on here, I'll do on the other one. Let's get our stamps out here. Whoops. And then I, mean, I want just a nice big flower. It's text and I know flowers all over here. And I move the words. Okay, I don't want to. I don't want to. Um, I 
don't want like a stem. I want something like this. What's stuck? Thank you, Mr. Butterfly. Have a look. Um, that one's good. I like that. And there's Frida. Oh, we need to use Frida. Oh, so I think we're going to use Frida. Yep. There's a nice big butterfly. gonna go like that we need to get a really big stamping block okay let's go like that this is archival black ink sorry your face is going the wrong way missus I don't want you sitting with your nose on the book book page there should have put you that side okay we're gonna we're gonna we'll just have to we'll make a plan okay let me just make sure she stamps all right just do a, a stamp off here yep okay so I think we'll go we can go like that we can go like that let's go let's go like this I was gonna put the butterfly over there but I think we're gonna put the butterfly down here okay so I'm gonna I'm gonna move her across no I'm not put her down there And I'm looking for, I'm just looking in my, my stamps here for a small butterfly, but I don't have a small one. I've got a small birdie, but birdies need things to sit on. Probably could have put her a bit higher, but we're done. Let's get this butterfly. And go. Okay, over there. <laughs> oh dear, let's hope we don't get to too much of a smudge, please. Okay, we're all right. We're all right. I'm happy with that. It's all right. And actually, it's not a, it is like that double thing. Okay, now Frida's chin looks a little bit, you can't see the purple's too dark. The purple is too dark, people. Let's get this, this here. Let me see if I can just come like this. And just kind of give her a bit of definition down this side. There we go. That looks a bit better. It's probably a bit too shiny for you guys, but can you see? Okay, I think I need another stamp because this is looking a bit odd. Okay, where's our other Frida stamps? I think, oopsie, I think I just broke my file. Right, let's go back where did we put it. Um, 
Frida, where are you? Here's our Frida stems. Oh, and we've got small little. Oh, here, oh, here is a small little butterfly facing the other way. Let's do that. And we have this framey bit. If I put this bit over here and this little butterfly going there, okay, let's put this one down there. Wait, it's gonna go. Oh, it's the wrong way. Why do I do that? We could put it over here. Actually, we could put it there like that. I think I might just go like that. No, it doesn't goo. It doesn't goo, woman. Don't try and make it goo. Let's put him there. Let's put him there. Let's just get a decent sized block. Okay, so I'm going to put him. Oh, he's gorgeous. I'm going to stick him right over there. So it looks like she's looking where he's going. There we go. That's a bit better. And I think I'm going to stick him on this side as well. Okay. And then I think we can call it a day folks on this page still have all that place to write and all the yeah okay so I'm happy with that that we can put a nice pocket on there and we can put a nice pocket on there and have some interest um, yeah I don't think I'm so I'm waiting for this page to dry and when it's dry, I shall on the inside do exactly the same as what I did here. Okay, I'm happy with that. And I think, let me, this was the first one. Is it drying on this? Hmm, not really. Okay, we'll give it a bit. We'll give it a bit. Okay. Okay, folks, I hope that gives you ideas for yourself to decorate your pages. And I'm going to be using this. I'm going to do exactly the same as what I did here, except I think I'm on the smaller journal. I might just use a smaller butterfly, first of all, and move her up a bit. So I might just do a couple of these. But I will show you at the end what I did. finished all the the stamping and that um, I, I used the head I just used a smaller thing than the great big butterfly and just added some some flowers that are going to be like that so I'm just gonna let this dry this one has dried so it is fine so yeah it's stuck on the thing uh, stuck on the cello tape sorry the thing so yeah so I'm very happy with that something different somebody can come and color that in if they want to afterwards so 
yeah well, that's us done for today so that was quite a, quite a a fun project anyway i will speak to you soon and have a great day cheerio now